Hello dear student today we will learn computer language our first chapter in this chapter you can uh, you can understand everything related to a first chapter so watch the video very carefully i hope so you enjoy the video so now let's start the video language is a medium to express our views and feelings to communicate with a computer we need a language that a computer understands for every action a computer has to be given instructions accordingly a program is a set of instructions that tells the computer what to do students let's know the fact lady ada lovelace a mathematician is regarded as the first computer programmer she was the daughter of famous english poet lord byron the process of writing specific instructions in a computer language is called programming Each programming language has its own specific rules. The programming languages have developed considerably due to the ease and ability of programmers to write powerful application programs. Students, please note that syntax are the rules governing the formation of statements in a programming language. The development of computer languages has been classified into the following categories. Computer languages first generation as machine language second generation as assembly language third generation as high level language fourth generation language students let's learn about machine language first generation it is the only language that a computer understands it is expressed in binary form that is 0 and 1 where 0 means off state and 1 means on state machine language has the advantage of very high speed and very low memory utilization but understanding and learning machine language is a tough and time consuming process it is very difficult to write and debug programs written in machine language The programs written in machine language are machine dependent. That is why machine language is also regarded as low level language that is LLL. A machine language program written on one computer may or may not run on another computer. Because of this very few people opt for specialization in machine language. Let me share a fact with you. The term software was first used by John W. Tukey in 1957. Okay, let me tell you about assembly language, second generation language. This language uses mnemonic codes or symbols in place of 0 and 1. For example, if the operation code for add is 0010 in binary language, it can be directly written as add in assembly language as assembly languages use symbolic codes. Hence it is easy to work with assembly language than in binary language. Since a computer can understand only machine language, so assembly language programs have to be converted into machine language. Translator programs known as assemblers were developed to convert the assembly language program into machine language. A program written in assembly language is called a source program whereas the program converted into machine language by the assembler is called object program or object code Like machine language assembly language is also machine dependent and programming in this language is quite time consuming thus it is also regarded as a low level language LLL All right we will discuss on the high level language third generation language The restrictions in the usage of machine and assembly languages prompted people to develop a language with the following features simple and user friendly language language that is machine independent owing to the above mentioned features it became easy to learn and use the computer languages A large number of people started writing computer programs using these languages. It is also known as high level language HLL. High level language is quite similar to the English language. Basic C, C++, Java etc are some of the very popular examples of high level languages. 
High level language programs need to be translated into machine language by using the translator programs. There are two types of translator programs which are as follows. Interpreter This translator program is used to convert a high level language program into machine language. An interpreter translates line by line, executes the instruction and then repeats the procedure for the remaining instructions. If any errors are found, they are to be removed immediately. As the converted form is not stored anywhere, so it has to be generated at the time of execution of a program. Interpreter programs are preferred for beginners and are slow in execution speed. For example, Suppose the French president is visiting India on an official tour. In order to understand each other, both the French president and the Indian prime minister would require an interpreter to translate the French language into the English language and vice versa. Similarly, in computers, interpreters are required to convert high-level language programs to machine-level language programs. Compiler is a translator program used to convert a high-level language program into a machine language. It translates the whole program at once. That is, it generates the object code for the program along with the list of errors. The execution speed of a compiler is faster as compared to an interpreter. Let us now move on and talk about the fourth generation language, 4GL. Fourth generation languages are more similar to human languages than their previous versions. Four generation languages are combination of languages with the following features. Highly user friendly and independent of any operating system. Very high speed of execution designed to reduce level of programming efforts. Minimum efforts from the user to obtain any information. Designed to reduce the overall time it takes to develop software and the cost of software development. In 4GL, the user has to specify only the required output they want, while the computer determines the sequence of instructions that will accomplish those results. Okay students, let us know more. Fortran was one of the earliest languages and was designed for scientists and engineers. COBOL was designed for business users. Now, let us briefly sum up about computer languages and their features. Machine Uses binary codes to depict operators and data. Machine dependent The only language directly understood by a computer. Assembly Uses mnemonic codes or symbol instead of binary numbers. Machine dependent has to be converted into machine language by translator programs, assemblers. High level. Uses English words and mathematical operators. Machine independent. Has to be converted into machine language by translator programs, interpreters and compilers. 4GL. Machine independent. Minimal user skills required to obtain results. Application Development Tool Students, let us know more. In Software Development, Beta Release refers to a product or a technology which is still in development but released only for testing and evaluation purpose. Okay, 